subscribe world action and reaction news warn and press bell button for getting notification of all future updates. Rafaeli, towards standard F4. Addressing the growing domestic and international demand for the French fighter aircraft, Dassault, and the French Defence Procurement Agency, DGA, has begun a six-year development phase of the next-generation Rafale F-4. On March 20, 2017, the French Minister for Defence, Mr. Jean-Yves L. E. Dryan, authorised the start of development of the new Rafale F-4 standard. The aircraft will introduce new capacities empowered by the modern missile and engine technologies. The new variant will follow the Rafale F-3 are currently in development and scheduled to complete the qualification testing next year. Dassault now produces Rafales to fulfill French orders for 180 aircraft, along with sales of 78 more aircraft for Egypt and India. The French Air Force could order additional 45 as it phases out older Mirage 2000 aircraft. The first fully equipped F-4 aircraft are expected to enter service in 2025, though certain functions will be available in 2023. It will be part of the fifth production tranche, 2019 to 2025, delivering on French and export orders. Since France plans to maintain the Rafale with its air and naval air forces at least through 2040, the French Ministry of Defence invests in the continuous modernization and upgrading of the aircraft. €1 billion Euros were allocated for the development of the current variant F3R, which will integrate the Meteor, MBDA's new extended range air-slash-air missile. Relying on a new AESA radar fitted to the aircraft the Meteor will be able to engage aerial targets from ranges exceeding 100 km. In the air-slash-ground domain, the F-3R variant will be cleared to carry the new target designation pod PDLNG from Thales. Other upgrades include the installation of an upgraded Link 16 terminal, improved Mod 5 compatible IFF and buddy refueling pods for the French Navy's Rafale N. Rafale pilot using the fighter Sphere tablet. Sphere is an integrated electronic flight bag, EFB, that greatly reduces pilot workload dealing with important but non-critical tasks during pre-flight and in-flight. Given its role replacing Mirage 2000 variants currently in service, Rafale F4 will likely include weapon integration modifications to include new variants of air-slash-air Mica, Scalp, and the nuclear cruise missile ASMPA currently deployed exclusively on Mirage 2000N. However, due to the relatively short span of the program, it is likely to focus mainly on capabilities based on software and limited hardware upgrades. Further, into the future, the program could introduce significant airframe changes, as part of the Rafale's midlife modifications. These upgrades could include cockpit redesign or introduction of low observability modifications to better position this 4.5 generation fighter against modern and future fighters. The F4 standard will incorporate operational experience feedback and enable continuous improvement of the Rafale to be maintained. It will reinforce the national skills and technological capabilities essential for preparing the development of the next generation of combat aircraft stated Eric Trapier, Chairman and CEO of Dassault Aviation. I am also delighted that the Defence Ministry underlines the need to continue with the acquisition of the Rafale, beyond the fourth tranche currently in production, in order primarily to meet the needs of the French Air Force, Trapier added. The Rafale entered service with the French Navy in 2004 and with the French Air Force in 2006. With more than 30,000 flight hours in operations, it has proven its worth in combat in Afghanistan, Libya, Mali, Iraq, and Syria. Beyond France, 180 aircraft ordered, the Rafale was ordered by Egypt, 24, Qatar, 24, and India, 32. 
Thanks for watching. I hope you like this news. Please share your views in comment box. Please like and share this video. Press subscribe button and bell for auto update to you regarding my channel world action and reaction news, warn.